Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel. Uh, today I want to talk uh, about uh, this little device, uh, Autocast Picasso, a device that allows you to turn your um, CarPlay into a multimedia workstation that allows you to watch all the videos in your car without limits. Autocast Picasso is a small and portable device uh, that you can use uh, with any car with CarPlay. How it works? It's very simple. Um, it replaces uh, the CarPlay system in your car with uh, another platform based on Android with all the features of this new operating system. So you can use uh, all the apps and functions that you cannot use with CarPlay. So uh, let's see how uh, to connect this device in your car. Just connect the uh, USB in the, the USB port in your car. Oops. Mm -hmm. And wait a few seconds that the system boot. Okay. And uh, this is the uh, interface. It's very simple and um, uh, easy to use. So uh, you can scroll from one screen to another and uh, these are the apps that we installed pre before. Of course, uh, the, first things, the first thing you have to do is to connect to the um, Wi-Fi. You can use your phone as a hotspot or you can put the um, SIM card or you can put a SIM card in one of the slots um, of the device. So once the connection is um, done, you can navigate through the app. For example, uh, you can uh, navigate uh, um, in internet using uh, the Chrome browser. Okay, um, such as Wikipedia or any other site you want. This is the user interface, it's uh, very simple. You can go through the apps uh, just scrolling uh, on the screen. And uh, here you can have a small navigation bar that uh, uh, appears just when you tap on the screen. So, um, of course you can install uh, all the apps you want. Just uh, go to the Play Store and search for apps and games uh, and install on your um, device, uh, such as a, a new uh, browser or any apps, uh, any app you want. Just to come back to the um, home, just tap here. Or if you are in the app, go to the back screen and then go to the home. Here you can find the last application you have uh, run. You can uh, reproduce uh, multimedia content on, um, on the device. For example, uh, maybe a YouTube video. So we can go to YouTube. And launch the video you want. Just to ask it, just to exit, you have to tap on the on button. For example, you can watch Netflix in streaming. Of course, uh, you have to have the connect. Of course, the connection have to be uh, speed to um, have uh, a good streaming. And of course, you can use uh, uh, other apps like uh, Google Maps, for example. And if you are, if you have more apps opened, you can go, you can activate the split screen, uh, just holding this button, and you can see 
for example, Netflix on the right and um, uh, Google Maps on the left and navigate and watch uh, and do whatever you want. To go um, to enlarge one screen or the other one, you have just to um, swipe uh, the finger on left or right. Of course, you can also reproduce multimedia contents that you have saved on the device through an additional memory card that you can put on the slot here. Maybe there is no light, but in the slot here. And you can um, expand so the memory of the device with an additional memory card. The device supported just memory of 128 GB, not more. This device works with touch displays like this one, but if your car doesn't have it, you can use physical controls or you can buy a wireless remote control. Of course, if you want to use your iPhone with CarPlay in, uh, in car and switch with this, um, this system, you have to uh, tap on this icon, Speed Play, and uh, the uh, device connected with your iPhone, showing CarPlay in the, uh, in the screen. So you can navigate on the apps uh, in your CarPlay. To go back to the other um, system, you have just to put the two. You just have to tap the screen and tap on the home icon here. The goal of this device is that you can use apps that you normally can't use on CarPlay, such as Netflix, but also other apps that you can find on the Play Store. Of course, not all the apps works on this device. You, can, you have to prove and test which one are the best and work, work better. Autocast Picasso is a very beautiful and useful device. It costs more or less 300 euros. Of course, it's an important cost, but it's worth for the functions that you have. First of all, for me, for example, that the plus is that you can't, cannot jailbreak your iPhone to use the apps that CarPlay do not allow you to use, doesn't allow you to use. Anyway, uh, you can find uh, where to buy the, this device and all the technical specifications uh, uh, of this Autocast uh, Picasso in the description of this video.